Hello everyone and welcome back for another edition of 8 Minutes with Aaron and you can see that I am so excited. One of my last videos got over 300 hits. That is crazy! Thank you very much for everyone who watched. Thank you for all my new subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And let's just get rolling with 8 Minutes with Aaron. There is a ton of stuff that I could start off with. First, I can talk about that Geico Fungo Pop that everybody was trying to enter yesterday, which wasn't really working. Today it did, however, and I've seen some people win them. Or we could talk about the Fright Night boxes that so many people are disappointed in. I guess they weren't happy with the Freddy Funkos or the way they were made, but I didn't really have time for that today because I had work! Ah, That's right, I had work, so I didn't have time to dive in and look and see what was going on. So we are going to revert back to our usual and give some things an oop and give some things a down. And we're going to start off with this box right here that I believe is from -da 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 -da, one of your favorites, Hot Topic! All right, we have this box from Hot Topic, and what is inside is your guess is as good as mine. I have so many boxes thrown all about here, I, I, I don't even know. I know I have one box that actually does have a lot of cool stuff from My Hero Academia. I also have some really cool stuff from Black Clover that I really want to talk about because... At first, I wasn't a real big fan of Black Clover, and I know I'm going off on a tangent right here, but Black Clover freaking kills it now. I don't know if anyone's watching it, but I think they're in a little bit of a hiatus right now. But once they get back, they are gonna kick ass. The time wizard, I can't tell you what happened. All right, let's open up this box from Hot Topic, and hopefully it is from Hot Topic. Boom! Oh, and it looks like we got four boxes inside. What could these four boxes have? Let's take one out, and we're going to put one here. And then we're going to take another one right here, and we're going to put it here. And hopefully, they're not the same thing, because I'm sure I ordered two of whatever it was. <laughs> All right, so the first box that we have here, it says X London 24 Pop Final. That looks very familiar. Let's open it up. You know what? I'm going to let you, the viewer, see it first. One, two, three! Whoa! Oh, what is this? It is a... Oh, it's the San Diego Comic-Con Starfire! What? Oh, man, I forgot I got these at Hot Topic. Uh-oh. I think I know what the other one might be. Now, this Starfire is a lot different than the Starfire I recognize because I do watch the Teen Titans Go!, and yes, I will admit that it was kind of crappy at first, but whatever they're doing now is on point. It is fire. If you haven't watched any of it, I know I'm in my 30s and I'm still watching cartoon shows, but I recommend it for everybody. That is how great it is. And if you haven't watched the original Teen Titans on Cartoon Network, oh yeah, you got to watch the first, what is it? I think it was like three or four seasons, maybe even five. They were going to come back for a six and I don't really know what's going on. Starfire is amazing. She's some, uh, you know, alien from another planet. Robin has the hots for her. On the cartoon show, she's a little dorky and, you know, she's really cool like that. And we're just going to put her down because we don't know if we're going to get an opportunity to open her depending on what could be in this box. And as I did mention before, it is a San Diego Comic-Con. As you can see, the sticker, it is a shared. It is not the official but I will be getting some officials at New York Comic Con. Give me that. Whoa! <laughs> no one's in here to give me some praise. All right. And the next one, it also says X London 24 Pop Vinyl. Which one could this be? I think I know which one it is. One, two, three. Whoa! What is it? Oh, it is a backwards. I got to see it first. It is Enmu. And I remember people were going crazy over this Funko Pop from Demon Slayer. It is also a San Diego Comic-Con. And just looking at this girl right here, or it could be a boy, I'm not really sure. I don't watch Demon Slayer like that, so I do apologize. Um, looks kind of... What is it? Inmu? She looks kind of emo? I mean, you know, look. 
She got the, you know, the white face. She got the black hair with the purple. I guess it's a little judgmental to say that she's emo. Uh, she could, you know, have some kind of cool power. She has like two kind of crazy eyes. I wonder if it's a uh, dojutsu, you know, like from Naruto, like they had the Ringin, the uh, Byakugan, they got Shoringin. Yeah, you know what I mean here. And uh, yeah, you know what? I think we're gonna have enough time to open these bad boys up and take a closer inspection. And I am gonna start with Starfire. Starfire is getting open. Yeah. And I do not believe that Starfire needs any kind of pedestal because the way that they made this Funko Pop is freaking sick. Her hair actually goes down in the fire form right around her to actually create the base. And if you see her hand, she has two little like, uh, I guess like blasts that she's gonna fire at somebody. This is really cool. I love the uniform. Uh, look, I'm gonna say this is a really sexy uniform. <laughs> Sorry, it's a very sexy uniform. No wonder why Robin got the hots for her. Uh, I'm gonna put this down before everyone calls me a creeper. And we're just gonna go into the next one <laughs> real quick and open up Enmu. Now Enmu, I'm just assuming, is going to have more clothes on than Starfire has. And she probably doesn't have the nice voluptuous hair flowing and the fire coming from her back. But Starfire's got that going on. All right, and then we got Enmu coming out here. And Enmu does have a stand. Look at this bad boy. We're gonna have to put that on the bottom cause we do know in 8 minutes with Aaron, if you cannot stand, you might get a down. Uh, so we're going to throw this on here. I will hold her up, him up. I keep... All right, like I'm not going to give a sex for this uh, uh, Funko Pop anymore because I don't, I don't want to say the wrong thing. And I'll turn this around here for you. I really do like it. I like the little blue things coming out the end. Um, I don't know if it's like the girl on My Hero Academia who has the kind of like uh, the cores that come down. Uh, the Mike, maybe her name's like Mike Girl. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, like the little black uniform. It looks like she's going to a concert. She reminds me actually of uh, that TV show where, oh man, why do I blank out on this stuff? Urgh. Umbrella Academy. Uh, the the seventh the the seventh girl. I can't remember her name. Um, when she would draw, draw, like, wore the black uh, suit and when she played the violin and started murdering people at the end of season one, they had to go back in time. I can't remember her name and I'll probably remember it later. But, you know, we're running out of time and you know what the biggest thing of this show is, them ups and downs, so let's get to it. All right, Starfire from Teen Titans. I think you know what you're getting. You're coming on the eight minutes with Aaron with this beautiful hair. The sexy outfit, the power things in your hands. You know what? I think you're getting an up. That's right, you are getting an up. That was an easy breezy cover girl up. And you know what we're gonna give you, Enmu? You're looking cool. I really don't know your abilities. And you know what? Maybe after this video, I will take a look. You are also getting an up. That's right, you are getting it up. You are getting up, up. We got ups all around here on 8 Minutes with Aaron today. My name is Aaron. Thank you for joining me with 8 Minutes with Aaron. I want to thank you all again for watching and subscribing. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And please like, subscribe, leave down in the comments. I love answering you guys back. I love the interaction. I will see you next time. Have a good one. See you later. Bye.